got our steps for the day. I just finished up a quick little cardio session there on the treadmill. But what I want to talk about in today's video real quick is stop watching us. So when I say stop watching us, you're probably wondering, one, stop watching what? And two, who is us? And when I'm talking about us and watching, I'm talking about anybody, including myself, in the educational space on YouTube or anywhere online teaching about how to build a specific business, whether it's drop shipping, affiliate income streams, whatever it is. And watching, I'm talking about any of the videos that I produce or anybody else in this space produces because recently all I see is people just watching and not taking any action. So I'm gonna get into a few details in a minute, but speaking on taking action, for those of you that are action takers, I actually have an opportunity for you to hop on a call with my team for some consulting. There's gonna be a link in the top of the description you can check out where you can speak directly with my team to analyze your ads your store and then we'll be able to figure out if you are in tune to work with my team and I with any of our training opportunities so that'll probably book out quick there's gonna be a top link in the description so go check that out but getting back to this video and what I'm talking about stop watching us I would say 90% of people that watch my videos never take action or really anybody online watching videos on how to build a business or how to build something you know you should be focusing on skill sets and learning these skill sets and I think my channel other people's channels are very valuable and you can learn a lot of things including myself I watch a bunch of different business people and learn from different people that I would consider mentors that I've never met but I'm constantly learning but at the same time I'm taking action on those things I'm learning I learn by taking action I believe fully in experience based learning so I actually had to do a senior project I'm actually a senior in high school so I haven't graduated um, but I haven't been in like actual class physically in probably almost two years now and you know what I had to do for a senior project was find an issue that I see in the world and then offer a resolution so what I did my project on was the education system here in America because you know too much of the education system is focused on retention and just remembering things to be able to put it on a test on paper and get a good grade and everybody's graded the same and all this conformity and just learning 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 and not enough experience for when you know people get out into the real world like I just recently moved out several months ago and I realized moving out from my parents house to my own house it's a big change uh, there's a lot of stuff you have to learn you know I had to set up my own electricity you know the internet I have to pay for rent utilities all this different stuff and it's like you have to learn about this stuff insurance and all this different stuff going on and you don't learn this stuff in school because you're taught based on knowledge and remembering that knowledge and not actual experience if they taught you you know how to, how to call the energy company and set up like your electricity when you move out that'd be pretty helpful but you know I have to do all this stuff on my own and learn on my own and that's sort of how I always have been in business and all this stuff I had a recent comment on my YouTube channel um, about someone saying you know did you have help from someone whether it's your dad your mentor or something from the start that really got you to where you were and a lot of people for some reason think that my dad's a very successful successful businessman uh, but no he's never owned a business he works for a company in nine to five but he enjoys it. I have nothing against it and uh, yeah it's just middle-class family it's nothing crazy he's not a millionaire he doesn't make a million dollars a year he just does what he loves and he makes money from it so you know he's enjoying life and I have nothing against that but for me I've always just wanted more and wanted to experience all this different stuff and I've never had that full-on help of someone guiding me along the whole way I've pretty much done most of my stuff through trial and error on my own until I got to a point where I was making enough money where I could invest in the different opportunities to learning from others to help cut the learning curve but I see way too many people are out here just watching these videos how to build a drop shipping store how to do all this stuff and then never taking action on it and I believe the one thing that's always going to beat knowledge and learning is just going to be taking action and actually gaining experience for anything in life because experience is going to be able to help you build that skill set and perfect it over time because everybody's gonna mess up so I'm actually mentoring two people right now um, I don't do a bunch of mentorship it's pretty rare that I do it I'm working with two people and there's one person I'm working with right now uh, pretty young kid he's actually been able to become successful on YouTube I was teaching just the fundamentals of e-commerce finding products testing products and I had him instead of just guiding him and doing everything for him and showing him how I do it I do one example and then I have him do the rest and then I go through and analyze to make sure he did it right and every time that he does something after I do it he's messed up but that's a good thing because he's gonna learn from that and he's never gonna make that mistake again if I was there doing every single little thing for him then he wouldn't be able to learn from experience and know not what to do and if he had to do it all on his own he's gonna probably mess up again and nobody's gonna be there to help him so that's why I'm mentoring him to help him get to that space and I'm teaching him by 
having him experience stuff. I'm not here just throwing words at him all, the, all day on these calls and doing all this stuff. I have him actually doing work on calls and outside of calls and then I'll analyze his stuff, make sure it's doing well. So what I want you to do right now, whether you want to get into any business, I don't care if it's drop shipping or anything, just start something, just start doing something. If you ever find yourself bored or not really sure what to do, if you feel like you're lost in life or whatever, just do something that's gonna be benefit you for the future. Like right now it's midnight and I just was on the treadmill for an hour just watching videos, just you know, chilling. But it's like, instead of sitting in my bed watching videos, I'm being productive just here in my treadmill. Now I know a lot of people maybe are like, oh, I don't have the resources or whatever, but you can can find a way just figure it out and you'll be able to make it happen and that goes with anything in life whether it's working out or building a business a lot of people are scared to make sacrifices um, you know time finance financially you know spending money on things people are just scared to do it but if you're actually invested and willing to do it then don't be scared you're gonna have to take risk but take calculated risk and now when I make this video, people are most likely gonna comment, someone's gonna comment or have the idea of probably like, oh Tanner, if you think learning's so bad and watching all these videos, why do you make them? Why do you have a course and all this stuff? So I think all these videos are great. Like I said at the beginning, my videos, other people's videos, I think courses are very good because you're able to cut that learning curve and you know, you're investing in yourself for a reason. Um, but the thing is, the most of the people that do buy courses and invest in themselves or pay for a mentor or something like that you know they're actually taking action you know they took the step to invest into themselves so now they're relying on themselves to get everything else done and make things happen and i think there's a lot of things you can learn and help minimize your risk with but it comes down to just taking action and applying that knowledge instead of just sitting on it so i spent the last probably week or so just doing calls from 11 a.m to 8 p.m and there were so many calls every single day that i was on when i get on the call I'm like, hey you know how can i help you out what are you having issues with whether it's ads your branding whatever you know i'm here to help you and they're like actually you know i haven't started i haven't decided i want to start yet i don't know what i want to do i've been watching your videos for a year i'm like thank you so much for the support i appreciate you watching the videos but it's like you know, what's the point if you're not taking action on If you spent a year watching my videos, that's great. You're gonna be learning stuff, but if you're never gaining experience and actually learning from your own failures and mistakes, then you're never gonna be able to grow because what I show and what I do is not gonna, you know, the results I get are not gonna be the exact same that you get because everybody has to try different things and, you know, sort of add their own twist to different people's strategies and methods. If there was just one method that worked for everybody, then everybody would be rich, everybody have a bunch of money, everybody would be doing whatever they wanted to do, but it's not like that, obviously. You see there's fundamentals to things, but then you have to learn and take your own twist on it and make it work for you, and that applies to anything in life. So focus on building skill sets and not as much as the learning phase. And back to my senior project on the education system, I offered a resolution where it was just more experience-based learning. And like I've talked about multiple examples throughout this video, that's what I truly believe in and what I want you to be able to experience. Um, so stop watching us. You know, don't stop watching us. I don't actually want you to stop watching my videos. Um, but, you know, start applying this information and actually trying things. I guarantee you're gonna see a lot more results doing that than just sitting here and watching these videos all the time. So I appreciate your support. Go check the top link in the description, book a call, and I would love to see you in there. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below or any video ideas, whatever you wanna see. You know, I appreciate all your guys' support. I hope you have a great Sunday, super productive Sunday. And also, there's free training in the top link in the description or in the comments, so go check that out. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.